Hello everyone, I'm Ravana and I'm happy to be here and share this delicious mango avocado ceviche with you. It's so, so, so good. I just came back from Merida, Mexico where I gave a conference and a workshop and I gave five recipes. And then after the workshop, I asked people, what recipe did you like best? And most of them said that they like the mango avocado ceviche better. So I know that this recipe, you're just gonna love it. It's super easy to make. And especially men were the ones who preferred this recipe. So if you have a little boyfriend or a little husband, or if you're like me that doesn't have anyone, but you wanna love yourself, this recipe is perfect for anyone and all ages. So what are you gonna need? Well, for our mango ceviche, we're obviously gonna need some mangoes. And mangoes in Mexico right now, guys, they were so good. Like, I cannot explain how good they were. So I just, I came back and I had to do something with mangoes. Mangoes, and I used approximately five mangoes, some tomato, and I used four tomatoes. Avocado, which was just like mango, tomato, and avocado is like the perfect, perfect combination. And I used one avocado, some green onion, cilantro, woo, and a little bit of serrano pepper just to give it that Mexican. And finally, we're gonna pour some lime juice over this and just mix it all and it's gonna make this beautiful concoction that ah, you're gonna wanna eat, but wait, because we have to make our tostadas. Ready? Let's do this! And for our tostadas, we're gonna use jicama. This is a delicious veggie that I just, I love, I love, I love. And its origin is from Mexico. It's super watery, kind of sweet, but not at the same time. It's so delicious, so if you have it available, I super recommend that you try it. And if you don't have it available, another option that you can do is just grab some romaine lettuce or any lettuce that you like and put your ceviche in there and then just and you have yourself a little mango ceviche taco. It's ready! And as you can see, I cut the jicama a little bit thick so that it won't break, okay? And it's just so perfect and I'm like, ah! Okay, here we go. It might get a little bit messy, but who cares? It's more than worth it. Okay. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna go and eat these because I just came back from a six mile run and I need a carve up. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do here below. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, you can do that here below. I upload weekly videos and if you like this recipe, give it a thumbs up, like it, like it, like it, share it, share the love of fruits and vegetables with everyone around you. I send you all a big hug and I'll see you next week.